Welcome back to another video and in today's video I'm gonna show you how you can match the colors of two layers. So usually we will have to go into Photoshop then do adjustments to the lighting and the colors and everything like that. But now Photoshop can also do this automatically by looking at the colors of one photo and putting these colors into the other photo so they match together like one piece, right? So let's go into Photoshop. All right, into Photoshop here, I'm gonna use this photo as an example and I'm not gonna spend some time on cutting them out. I'm just gonna use the select subject function to get rid of the background and select him. So let's make a mask here. And for the background, I'm gonna use a sunset background like this and just simply put it there behind him. And I wanna share I match the colors because you can see here, it doesn't look real, right? It's not looking like he's really there at the sunset. So I wanna try out Photoshop to see if Photoshop can actually fix this problem, right? So let's go to filter and select neural filters. And in neural filters, you have this option. And let's go here into harmonization. You can see it's still beta, so it probably has some flaws, but I think we can still use this. So if you cannot use this, make sure you have two layers and one layer has a mask. And let's select the first image. Here we wanna select this one for the lighting, and then it's gonna process this. And you can see here, it already made this better. Now we can also adjust this here a bit. I would add a little bit more red to this because we have like really red kind of background and press okay. And now let's compare the before. Let me put control Z. This was before and after you can see here, it matches this background a lot better. So that's how easy you can actually match the colors of two images if you are a bit lazy to do this yourself and if you don't want to spend time on learning Photoshop. So thanks for watching. This was a quick video on how to you can match the colors in Photoshop by letting Photoshop do the work actually.